Welcome Scorpio to Petrella's Intuitive Insights. This is a brief overview of November 1st to the 15th of 2020. And as I was getting into the Scorpio energy, I really felt that the giving and receiving has been completely out of balance for the Scorpio. So um, whether this is the Scorpio that loves to give, 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 and yet when somebody wants to give back, you don't know how to accept it and just let it rest. And if you can't do that, that makes an imbalance. And that imbalance is just as grievous as, as the imbalance of um, always receiving, 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 and not giving. So I feel that that's something that the Scorpio really need to uh, pay attention to in love, romance, relationship, in life in general, is the giving and receiving. I feel that you need to do what you know is best and stand up for what you believe in. This is love, romance, and relationship. Stand up for what you believe in. I feel that um, when it comes to career and finance, I feel that there's going to be a completing of goals, yet the budget's going to be extremely tight. So I feel that you're going to be able to make things work, but it's going to be extremely tight. But you're going to get through this period of time, Pisces. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of details, and there may be a little of, uh, and this is with light, uh, money, finance, I feel it may be pertaining to the house. Um, there may be, uh, you, you may have thought that it was gonna go one way and it went another way. Look, <clears throat> this is where your love, romance, and relationship, you need to uh, be fair and just in decisions. And when I say that, you need to also look from the other person's point of view this is where the give and take may also be a play for the Scorpio this is so important yep there you go oh look at this see these cards came flying out of the deck this is the masculine energy card and this is all about the home so is the Scorpio, are you changing your home, doing major renovations, changing things around? Are you actually moving? Are you uh, preparing the move? Is the house going to be sold? This card just came out again. This is actually the moving card. So this is telling me the Scorpio may be moving. And I do feel that it is, uh, is it in a Scorpio's, best interest is this move November 1st to the 15th and I do understand this will not apply to all the Scorpio but it does apply to many of you I do appreciate the kind comments the likes shares and the subscribes the private readings I, I, I am grateful this okay now these cards the male and female cards aren't necessarily supposed to be in a deck but here's the feminine card came flying out of the deck. So I'm going to leave that out because I feel that this move has a lot of uh, positive feminine overtones. And these cards also came out of the deck. The star card. Good fortune card. Money card. This is the key card. Uh, and now, this is, ooh, lightning is disagreeable depending on how far away it is. But look, it's pretty far away and we got the awards card. So I gotta tell you, Scorpio, it looks like if you've been planning on selling your house, it's sold. Uh, I just really feel that this is where the giving, the receiving, and making just decisions. Now these cards also fell out. The celebration, the snake, the clover, which is good luck, and this is 
shock. Like you're gonna get shocking news. And I feel this is all. This is about career and finance. So we're, we're rolled into that. Career and finance, Scorpio. What do the Scorpio need to know as they watch this video pertaining to career and finance? Scorpio. November 1st to the 15th of 2020. The snake again. Okay. So you're going to get... Uh, it's going to be like a struggle. Finance. Uh, you may have the money coming in, but it's going right back out. But look, you're going to be okay. And again, here's this shocking news. This is about finance. But here's this clover again. Now you watched me. You watched me shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Look, we're just going to go ahead. I'm going to stick these in different areas of the deck. And we're going to continue on with love, romance, and relationships, Scorpio. Look, I got to tell you, just buckle your belts for this particular time. And you are going to retrieve what you thought you had lost, Scorpio. Okay. So some of you may be taking a trip during this time. This is love, romance, and relationship. And it is really good luck and a very joyful uh, trip. Love, romance, relationship. Scorpio, November 1st to the 15th of 2020. What do the Scorpio need to know as they're watching this video? Yeah. You're going to take the best and leave the rest when it comes to relationships. You are really intelligent. And really, you know, see, here's the snake again. You need to be careful with the snake. Scorpio. Yeah, it feels like a male energy around this, this snake energy. So, Scorpio, pay attention to whether it's at work, the relationships at work, and your family, your friends, pay attention to the snake. Um, just be extra cautious about it. It looks like you're making movements when it comes to your house uh, and properties. So um, if this resonated with you, please like, share, and subscribe. If you would like a private reading, please click the link below to patrellasintuitiveinsights.com. And thank you very much, and God bless you.